Okay, so I want to talk about my experience. I am a currently working for contractors as an electrician. And so what we do is other companies uh, get job contracts, look for contractors to help them do their dirty work. And we go out and, and do it. Um, so as an electrician in the construction industry, we'll run conduits, uh, put up strut, just stupid crap. Run wires through the, through the, through the conduits. Um, so, I mean, that's, there's sometimes you run MC, MC cable and so on and so forth. Um, it's a very basic job. Um, in South Africa, I was a maintenance electrician before I came out here, so <clears throat> had experience with conveyor belts, mole, mole maintenance, substation maintenance, stuff like that. You need a bit more brains for that. Um, construction electricians, um, you can be stupid as hell and become one. <laughs> it really doesn't require much brain power. Um, for my latest one, it was supposed to be a year contract, nice and close to my home, 15 minutes. But we had a narcissist foreman, little short boy, short man syndrome. And he was just a dick, but all insecure dick from the beginning. And um, so I always got there about 30 minutes. We, we worked from 6 to 2.30. I got there most of the times before the foreman did and had to wait for his shorter ass to come open the gate. Did everything I was supposed to. And so when we first started there, since this was the beginning of this construction uh, for a hospital, um, all we were doing is running strut. Now, that company, Denier, had their own electricians and they ran some strut and when me and one of my co-workers from our company um like i said we're contractors we ran uh we put up some strut and every day he would ask us how much have you done how many pieces of strut have you put up and so on and so forth <laughs> That's why one of my co-workers phoned our uh, recruiting manager and told him about this little pushy, short, narcissistic dick. Um, and, uh, you know, the one day I'd run 23, told him that the next day, because I had to fix up a lot of the shit that their people had done, their electricians had fucked up on the strut, not tightening bolts, not getting it level, putting it in the wrong place, etc., etc putting it at the wrong height. Um, so, um, the next day, uh, my coworker had, he asked him, you know, how much he had run, he said 24. And so, he had told us while well, his people were running uh, between 50 to 80 a day each, putting up strike, leveling it out, putting up beam clamps, all of that shit. And when I went and asked them, personally, they told me they were running between 17 and 24 a day. It's humanly impossible to run more than that at this location. This is getting on a lift, getting your strut pieces up, cutting them to size, getting your, your uh, all threads in there to the right length, so on and so forth. So this bitch boy, the foreman, had lied to us and said, no, they were running 50 to 60, even 80 a day. What a lying sack of shit. What a lying piece of shit. Instead of saying good job and encouraging us, you're trying to break us down. You know why? Because he was a little bitch that was bullied at school. One of those little bitch boys. And so, let me light my fucking cigarette off here. uh so what happened was another one of my co-workers had joined us and he started to run conduit and he got to a section 
and they told him they told him to pull it all down and redo it because his couplings weren't lining out this is all going to be under sealing so it's not going to be exposed it's not going to be exposed anyway they waited for him to run all of that and then told him this last week friday i get to the office he tells me have you uh, and he stutters by the way like a little bitch uh, uh, have you uh, you, you got got all your 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 tools I said, yes, bitch boy, I've got all my tools, bitch. Stuttering, bumbling, fuck. And he said, okay, because you, you, you won't be coming back on Monday. You fucking bitch. I did everything I was supposed to, you little fat fuck. Little short boy. I did everything I was supposed to. Never did anything wrong. Uh, while we would work, your bitch boys would stand around talking shit talking the biggest load of shit well we would work like slaves you fucking fat fuck and so when i questioned him about this he just said well so sometimes it's just not the uh, per right person for the, the, the job these bitches never asked me once to fucking run conduit i guarantee you I can run conduit 10 times fucking better than you short fat fuck this is the same little short fat fuck that pulled in cable uh and uh ripped it up wasted the whole cable tore the sheathing off because he's had a sloppy shot joint when pulling the cable in and he's a foreman and that's why i say these dumb fucks were working construction their whole lives they don't you know they can never become a maintenance electrician. You you don't need much brains to fucking run uh, to be a, become a construction electrician. You really don't. This is like basic shit for me. Stupid shit. People that couldn't make it as a maintenance electrician. Um, but yeah, I just want to... And, and that's probably why he's got such a stutter because he was bullied as a child. But you know what? If you are bullied then you don't expect to try and do that in the workforce you little short shit because you're trying to get back at the world because you were such a fuck up in the world the world bullied you and you try and bully people under you well i can tell you my skills 10 times greater than yours could ever be you'll die my friend before you even have the skill i had at 25 and i'm way past that now you dumb bitch so this is what fucking how narcissists operate in the workplace um i think he got jealous because i used to pitch up at work before him worked better than him <laughs> for a foreman to rip up a fucking cable and cost their company money and then say somebody else needs to go because they're not the right person they're looking for fuck you fat fuck dumbass bitch um and then wait till friday to tell me this though they probably decided this I assume he did a few days before that so that I can get a new location, you dumb bitch, so that my company can put me on a new spot. So you try to fuck me up the ass, but now you fucked yourself up the ass because this video is going to stay forever, bitch. Just a fucking little insecure, little small man syndrome narcissist. That's all you are. A man with fucking less skill than a fucking 18 year old. And that's all you'll ever be a fucker. Just remember that. Small boy. Stuttering, bumbling fool.